Hey guys, what's up? It's Wolf, your one and only. And before you notice it, yes, I have changed my audio. I've gone back to using like voice meter banana uh, because yeah, I just wanted to see if I could make it like sound way more clearer, way more crisp, way more like natural and somewhat it is. So I'm probably going to keep it like this. Remember, this whole Octopath Traveler is our, you know, our editing series, our pretty much testing series, you know, and it's perfect for that just because of all these things that are in here. So first off, uh, today we're probably going to do like a five hour recording session of Octopath Traveler just so I can have like five episodes ready for whenever I go to work or something like that, because you guys know I work, you know, labor job so you know i come back home really is i really exhausted and tired and i go straight to sleep it's it's a common thing you know just full-on labor picking up heavy things taking them to different locations around the store and everything stocking shelves so yeah <laughs> i come home exhausted i go to sleep and i just full-on forget it forget to record the things because when i get home i'm like extremely tired and i just can't be asked for that point but yeah that's probably what we're gonna do it's either gonna be very weird just because i'll probably won't like do an outro and it'll randomly end or either i might separate them all into like five different recording sessions which will probably be a better idea if anything just because you don't want like four hours of footage just randomly you know, being screwed up versus like just having an hour that screwed up and I could just time skip and just be like, hey, guys, we missed a few things, you know, stuff like that. That's what I want to do. But yeah, let's start over. <laughs> hey, guys, it's Wolf, your one and only how all my adventure is doing. Hope you guys are having a fantastic day today. We're going to be going into I don't know who this character is. Oh, I'm not going to pronounce that. I think I'm good. I'm pretty sure the story will pronounce it. <laughs> No, oh, and she even talks very weird. It's gonna be quite the interesting little series to do because I kind of want to get V, which is base, not V, Z. I kind of want to get Z involved too, which is basically, if you guys don't know, is our new mascot for our, you know pretty much my whole channel now be our little ai that i interact with now and then so i'll probably get her to read these little uh these little screen things here maybe i'm not sure i just have to find a lot of like things i want to involve her in you know sort of like bickering stuff like that give her her own personality or persona for the channel it's, it's going to be interesting to figure like all this new stuff I'm doing out. Yeah, take her along. Hear a story. Doggo. Good. Thou hast yet to depart. Oh god, that's how she's speaking. That's gonna be annoying. Oh, that's not a dog. What the fuck? Waylaid by that's, sentiment. That's little cat. <laughs> the other one's a doggo, though. It'd it'll behoove me to leave without bidding my favorite prentice. Yeah, I'm not gonna read any well. of this shit just because that's gonna be annoying trying to read in her tongue. And I think I'm I think I'm good. <laughs> Can't be asked. A joke, as always. I like her voice though. Will thy journey be long, master? Ah, oh, a good question, that. The request cometh from none other than the Knights Ardant. The hunt will take us to distant lands, and the beast we pursue in is a fearsome one. I see. Ha ha ha! Look and not so glum, girl! I'm no Tyro with green arrows and bruises on his bow arm. I feel like this is like very close to a Viking speech. I'll do the deed and be back before two moons have passed. 
I call bullshit. <laughs> Still no smile? What is it, my girl? Tis not the hunt that concerneth me. Thou intendest to stop and off somewhere along the way. Oh, been caught out. Oh, here and there, mayhap. Why dost thou ask? Thou forgettest or feignst ignorance, so I will remind thee. Damn. On the last hunt, thou gambledest away thy purse and came back a poorer man than thou left. Oh, well, shit, dude, really? You, well, I can see why there's trust. Oh, God, where did that whistle come from? <laughs> but I can see why there's trust issues in that. Poor in coin, mayhap. Yes, I did make a few wagers at the arena in Victor's Hollow. So first off, I, I have never made that whistle noise in my life with my mouth. <laughs> did, did I just pull like that old man from like a family guy whistle? I'm not even fucking sure. That's probably going to be loud. I got to have to either edit that out or lower it because I'm pretty close to the mic right now. And learned that while I have a keen eye for assessing the strength of beasts, I am quite at a loss with men. A valuable lesson that was cheaply bought. Okay. <laughs> Not so cheap in the end. Eliza had to pay him thy debts, and thou only finished its paying her back this last moon. Promise in me, Master. No more foolish gambling. He's gonna come back completely nude. <laughs> Everything off his back. But what of the old hunters saying? If the first arrow faileth, knock a second and try again. Oh my god. <sighs> Thou just madest that one up. Come now, girl. Thou art too young by half for such world weary sighs. Must thou makest our parting so gloomy? Yes. If you can't be trusted, you can't be trusted. <laughs> I turn to thee, Hagen. Looking after Master, for he can rarely be bothered to looking after himself. Damn. <laughs> Even thou takest her side against me, old friend? He knows yeah. good sense. I was about to say, he knows you can't be trusted. <laughs> <laughs> Growl Thou not at me, thou faithless turncoat. Hail, Hanit. Have you come to see us all? Hanit. Okay, that's how you pronounce her name. I wasn't going to try and butcher it at all. Master about straying from the path. And I thank you for it. I do not have the leaves to pay another debt like that. Have I not a single ally in this infernal village? Well, but when everybody figures out your gambling addiction, your friend, then yeah. But I am also a knight ardent, and your client. You would do well not to forget this. Not for a moment, most honorable Lady Eliza of the illustrious Knights Ardant. <laughs> That's more like it. Fear not. I'll keep him out of trouble. I'll have him fill his evenings penning a detailed account of our adventures on the hunt. Taken care, and may thine arrows strike true. I shall look after the forest till the day of thy return. Thank thee, my girl, and farewell. Oh. Okay, then. A year hath passed since that day. He's probably gambled away all, all his clothes and everything. Even gambled her away somehow. <laughs> in all that time, Master could only be bothered to send in a single letter. Hornet, tis me thou revered Master. Missest me? I won't bore thee with any blather about the weather or the season. Who knoweth when this will even arrive, after all? 
For three months now, I have pursued the trail of the beast sought by the Knights Ardant. A beast by the name of Red Eye. That's their name for it, leastwise. As for its true name, if it even hath one, none can say. Red Eyes it must be a druggie. That's, that's what it is. <laughs> But on my father's bow, I swear, tis the most vexing quarry I've ever had the misfortune to hunt him. It eludeth mine every trap, and, though thou may thinketh me mad for saying this, I swear it can even senseth every move I make. I know not if it is human intelligence or pure animal instinct, but either way, it refuseth to be caught. Still, we appear to have annoyed it sufficiently that it is moving on to new pastures. Judging from its behavior, I believe it meaneth to make for the lands around Stoneguard. I will be frank with thee, my girl, who thou hast always been able to see through my pretenses. The chase will be hard, and the hunt will not endeth soon. But fear not, for endeth it shall. Hast thou ever known your master to fail in a hunt? Hey, dude, uh, don't jinx that. Everything happens once at least. And sometimes that one fell is all it needs for there to be no more fells or success. And so I ask thee, my dear apprentice, pray look after the village until I return. Yay. Oh, and be not a worry, Wart. Always thy friend and teacher, Zanta. Never heard Master admitteth that any hunt would be difficult. Either this red eye is truly the most formidable of beasts, or he's or wrong. He stoppeth in every gambler's den from here to Stoneguard. Yeah, nah, nah, <laughs> whichever one. But no, Master liketh to act in the fool, but when it cometh to hunting, if he saith he will catcheth his quarry, then catcheth it he will. Her? Yes, Linda, I know. Master entrusted the safety of the village to me. My duty now is to the villagers. Come in. Let us visit in the headman and see if anyone hath need of my bow. Okay, then. So, what is your trick with other people? Good day. No, no you don't have one, apparently. There's the inn. Here's the shop. Hello. So, this is probably going to be our final adventurer then we're just going to continue through the story we'll naturally get the rest over time we're not going to push like too far end up getting all the other ones i'm pretty sure we'll get all the other ones naturally over time i don't think there's really too much of a rush to aim for all of them this fast i am haunted hello Sometimes I wonder how uh, the masters. Mm, yeah, okay. I see. Hmm. Dude, yes, teach me. Teach me the ways. Asking ye.
Yes. All right then. I'm wondering how her gameplay is gonna go out. Okay. I oh I can provoke people to fight me. Oh, that sounds like fun. Letting us begin in. Letting the hunt begin in. Oh wait, what? Okay, so I can summon an ally. Oh, that's that's kind of dope. Jesus Christ, she's big as fuck. <laughs> so summon beast is gonna be her main thing. Blind. Damn. Okay. My quarry. So I'm kind of curious. Is that gonna use like? Now then. So. Oh. But anyway, I was thinking to myself, is that going to be her main attack? She doesn't use like bow or anything. Standest thou against me? Then be hunted. Letting my arrow fly in true. Yeah, so I can't change to anything else. This is the only things we have. So it's not like she's gonna. Okay, yeah, it also does use like these stacks too. So Forest Fox will be going down because it was like five. Let's use this one. So this one just straight up heals. What next? And it's a piggy. Yeah. I don't know if this increases the damage of her. I think it does. It just doesn't have the level shown the for some reason. Beginning. I honor thee, my quarry. Okay, not bad. I kind of like her so far. <laughs> and the cat, cat's just laying down, chilling. Well. Uh, yep. Excellent. I don't know. I kind of feel like using the giant cat is cheating. Hello there. Hmm. Um. Well, really. Hmm, something must be up. Well, I'm kind of right. curious what Harnet has as skills. Hmm. Mayhaps, mayhaps. Oh, okay, I can't even look at the skills now. Greetings. Hmm. I see. Hmm. I don't like her design so far. Mm. I'm asking ye. Dude, just this nice ambience going on during this story is always like really nice. Mm. You guys probably won't hear it just because I have music over it probably. <laughs> Splendid. I am ready. I'm asking ye. Fair befallen thee. 
Okay. We're well, talking to our contractor, basically. Nay. Okay. Eh. Your quarry is to be a fearsome beast that have wandered into Whisper Woods from the gods nowhere. Mm. Yes. Hey, just this morning, a merchant and a injured companion. Oh. So the campaign got beat up. The merchant was just like, dude, I'm just trying to sell shit. Don't hurt me. <laughs> this bodeth ill. Well, actually. Truly. Yeah, basically like one of those moments of you weren't our first choice, but you're our second, so you know <laughs> I am ready. She said she shall not fail, but you know it's me behind the controller. <laughs> I don't know what else to give you. It's, it's me of all people behind the controller. <laughs> That's the best you're getting. <laughs> that ass. Oh, just... <laughs> mm. Okay, so now we got the whole team. We're about to go in there. We're going to see how well she uh fits in with us. I mean, considering she's done doing this much damage within that, I feel like she's going to fit perfectly. Question is, does she actually use a bow though at this point? Considering she hasn't changed weapons. Oops. Accessories. Okay, she does use a bow and axe. Okay. Bow and axe, no sword. But I really don't need sword considering that he has a minion that summons with the sword, so not too much of anything too bad there. Uh, we're going to choose this one for a higher damage. Never mind. Okay, I'll just go fuck myself because I forgot I put it on her. <laughs> Don't pick this up an axe or anything. That would be really good on her yet. I have a helmet. One thing that would go down is the defense. But it would evenly break up other two. We have Rose, but that'll bring down the defense too. We can give her the critical necklace, amongst anything else, and we need to see what skills she has. Okay, so for skills. Oh, attack an enemy. We're up to five times. The bow. Oh, wait a minute. So if I go into her uh, provoke, it means the cat fights for me. I think outside of it, in like actual battles, we use our bow. I think that's what's going on, which would make a lot of sense, though. Your chance in accuracy could be grab, could be really good to grab. 
we have these two attacks uh thunderbird could also be interesting okay cause a single foe to act at the end of the turn for two turns I have no idea what the fuck that means but okay Otherwise, okay, so this could be really good for Goad. So she's actually extremely useful for one HPing somebody that I need to take gold from. So I would take this mercy shot and then this really then Thunderbird last then I could go into arrow storm but which is arrow storm oh yeah I can go to this mercy shot then arrow storm then trap then Thunderbird I think that would be a lot better situation there hold up make sure she doesn't have anything that she needs to be equipped oh okay seems like it's fine there we go well let's go ahead and save so we don't have to go through story again and let's get to working letting us begin in Come yeah, in, bitch. If thou darest. <laughs> Let in the hunt begin. In. <laughs> Come in, if <laughs> thou darest. No big damage or anything. Noted. Thou didst fight with courage. So will he be knocked down on the ground? Okay, yeah. So he, he's knocked down on the ground once you're done with the provoke. So I'm guessing move this way, then move back. Will he be back up? Yeah, okay, yeah. He could just challenge him again from there. Interesting. But it's only her fighting. So I'm thinking that's exactly how it goes. Just she ends up fighting with her... Uh, Summons. I wonder how you would get more though. Maybe she has a skill for taming. Okay. Let's see those. I've done my research on you. What to do? Okay. Uh, let's see. Ah! What next? Okay, beast lore, capture. Okay. So she, the mercy shot is going to be really good for taming. But it kind of depends on like what we can tame though. Now. Yeah, she's going to be pretty awesome. do my best yeah we still have him that's funny <laughs> let's do this so with that alone I can just Thank you. Oh, okay or not okay fuck me right <laughs> oh flames wrong what next so if I was to Claim this now. Oh, it would even give the strength of it too. Okay. It even tells us if it has slash or anything like really amazing. Um, so if I was to summon my cat, it wouldn't stay on the field, it would just well, literally use that attack and it would be done. Is the logical course of action. 
You should have studied harder. Alright, so those are going to be really good for leveling up uh, Harnet for her Provoke, though. Especially if I get, like, some really good strong monsters. Which is going to be great. Yeah, we're in the forest now. Oh, well. So he's just killing people for fun now, huh? Park. This boat is ill. If thou wilt, thou hast my thanks. This weird pixel effect above this text is annoying me for some reason. Unacceptable. I mean, yeah, that is kind of true. Like, if you had, like, a lion killing everything it saw, it would actually injure themselves and... Like other things around it that need that food. Which, you know, it, it makes a lot of sense. So, yeah. Uh, which way should we go? Should we go down here? Yep, that's loot. I never use those stones, they just sit in my inventory. <laughs> this battle evasion, now, like, support skill is actually really nice. Okay, now, so what we what can next? do... Nothing will quiet the storm. ...is get them to be stunned. Here I go. And also try and take from them now. Thank you! What next? So, capture. What do you guys have? You have strike. Ooh, these foxes are actually really... Oh, this one's extremely powerful. Okay, so they all have their different strengths. That's what it is. I might have to get Mercy first. Mercy just seems like it's, like, so much better right now. Uh, we're gonna hit this guy. Well then. Try and lower his HP more than anything. Thank you. Come in if thou darest. Okay, so we captured what him. Next? Uh, go ahead and try and kill the rest of them. My turn now. Let your wounds be healed. Nice try. Oh, okay. <laughs> Ow. Go. Okay. Well done. Thank you. What is the last one? The last one is the fox, which I'm pretty sure will survive. Nothing will fight the storm. Oh, oh, never mind. <laughs> the not fox bad. definitely did not survive. <laughs> 
Okay, so we have enough JP for our first uh, skill for Hornet or Hornet, whichever way you pronounce it. Uh, skills, learn. Okay, so first things first, Mercy Strike might be the best because we're playing Pokemon at this point. <laughs> then we'll come for a take aim. Uh, we can heal more. Or illuminate or we can get a reflect we can get elemental defense i say we might want reflect and elements but at the same time we should probably take more healing just in case we get into one of those really troublesome battles uh everybody else requires 500 uh, as for donate BP, it might be a thing that I grab. Okay, hold on a second. Okay, so it's not going to show it unless I actually have points ready for it. Noted. All right, let's go. I say we go this way, maybe a chest. So apparently, uh, he's has like a way you can earn gold faster than any other character in the game, other than, uh, other than collect. It's that little passive that she has. That when you go into a different area, you can just steal a whole bunch of, uh, well, not still. You can grab or have a chance to grab a whole bunch of gold. It doesn't like it has like a little timer for like every area. That's something I plan on doing soon. Just so I don't have to do it through like battle. I can just re into areas over and over again. Letting my arrow fly and true. Okay, so red fox. See how much damage he's got. Holy shit! Okay, yeah. All right, good, good job, red fox. I, I see how much damage you do now. I think, I think, uh, capture is going to be easier to deal with when you think about, think about it. Oh, flames! And I'm hoping I'm able to capture bosses, like summons and stuff like that. If I'm able to capture bosses summons, you know how legitimately OP that's gonna be. Letting my arrow fly and true. Oh, I was trying to hit the fox, but you know, hey. Well then. Get him my out of here. Now. Or I could just collect. Thank you. I swear, if that would have failed what off of ninety nine percent, I would have had a lot of questions. Now, what next? My focus. Nice try. What next? Thou didst fight with courage. Okay. We're all leveling up here. Hey, dude. Yeah, I need the good stuff in here. And now you just got mostly heal potions and stuff like that. Nothing like extremely off the charts. Uh, sooner or later, I'm going to have to start selling a few things just to see what I'll get out of it. But people, but from what I've heard, late game is going to be a lot more gold heavy. The strategy is mostly just for like early, early and mid. Okay. This guy looks very freaky. Not acceptable. I wonder if I can capture it. <laughs> Bro, if I can capture this shit, oh my god, capturing bosses, that would be dope as fuck. Yeah, raw yourself, fuck you. <laughs> we 
We are gonna have to see how big his HP pool is, though. So we'll probably analyze. I see. Dude, staring at this thing is like a fucking nightmare fuel. Can we not? <laughs> gonna roar at me again and tell me to fuck off <laughs> I just know it I think he wants your forgiveness I knew it he was just gonna roar at me again <laughs> fucking <Ugh>. dick <laughs> ew oh if god he's even more idea. nightmare fuel up up like front uh put him out of his fucking misery jesus christ <laughs> okay so wind attacks are out of the question uh oh the, what the f okay then yeah th this is great <laughs> fucking amazing dude the fuck? <laughs> this guy's a fucking asshole jesus Untamable. Okay, good. They they tell me what's tameable and what's not tameable. Cool. So, uh, fuck now. me, right? <laughs> just just fuck my healer. Give it the whole thing. Uh, okay. For some reason, it's not telling me what items do. Okay, because X hides text. Did not know that. Let me help. What next? What if I... Yeah, boost it. Oh, no. Okay. Fair enough. Okay. So arrows is the weakness. This guy's gonna have a lot of HP. So let's go ahead and use this. Make them vulnerable so we can do some real damage. Ah! Holy oh, shit. Ah, yeah! brother, calm down. The fuck, bro? Jesus Christ. <laughs> Who made you this way? Who hurt you? Someone must have really hurt you. <laughs> I'll not be defeated. <laughs> Tell that to the fucking rest of the team who's about to die. Letting the hunt begin it. Yeah, beginning it. Uh, I don't think staffs are weak. Nope, staff are definitely not weakness. Um, first off, we're gonna do this it's just because I don't want you having to turn because it's absurd already. <laughs> um, we'll maximize this, get a good 600. We're gonna. Go ahead, low Let heal everybody. Get fully capped out. Letting the hunt and begin then. It. Nobody told you to change your weapon. Go back. Thank you. Since our cat clearly doesn't do that much damage compared to whatever the fuck he just did. Back nothing. Yeah, just fully charge that bitch. It's fine. Oh damn! Good job, My Red Fox. Now. Jesus Christ, that's some that's some good old damage, brother. That's some good old damage. If you if you know what I'm saying. Yeah, give me your gold. Ooh, that's a huge chunk. Don't hurt me after this, okay? <laughs> Light is what you're super effective to. I think right now we're gonna be saving up our uh, vulnerability points. Because it seems like I don't think there's going to be anything higher. So let's go ahead and reveal the last one. The last one is ice. Okay. So just basic attack right now. Oh, oh wow. Okay. Yep. Fuck Silas. Can we never have that again? You fucking bitch. The fuck? <laughs> I would totally cleric the shit out of that if it wasn't going to just drain the shit out of our... Uh, Shit, we just got, but you know, hey. Chop, chop. Alright. And then we're just gonna do a little bit of butt. Oh, never mind. <laughs> we're gonna do a little bit of a potion. <laughs> because, uh, we got nothing else on that. Um. We're gonna use T 
he's for weakness. An interesting dilemma. Let's go ahead and use our lightning to get a few more turns off that. What to do? She's gonna be our main weakness killer. Huh? Yeah, what, mate? Yeah, you know what? No. Fuck that noise. Uh, I don't know who told you that you're going to do a fucking retarded amount of damage, which you're probably going to do either way. You you don't give a fuck. Let's be honest now. <laughs> Never mind. I totally forgot that she has that, but she also has a chance of missing it as well. I'll do my best. So that's why accuracy comes into play off of that uh, take aim. So we're going to go ahead and uh, give him the pain. <laughs> Let's do this. Because clearly that's what the fuck he wants. Uh, no more back. Coming if thou holding back nothing. We're gonna hit him with another summon. Anything else wouldn't make any sense. Considering that we still have this red fox, and this red fox is like amazing right now. Now, what next? Like, holy shit, this red fox uh, is just like ridiculously amazing. Oh my god, damn, dude. What the fuck did you just pull that fucking dick out? Jesus Christ. That was that was unnecessary at all. <laughs> Fucking ass. <laughs> um Since we already have collect off. Might as well basic. We're going to go ahead and nice. Ice win. Don't want to waste a turn right now. An interesting We're going to ice storm again. Never mind. Um we're gonna defend just because I feel like he's gonna BS again. Oh uh, yep. Yeah. <laughs> Called it. Letting my arrow fly Is that a tree. counter? It's you piece of fucking shit. This man has a fucking counterattack. So if I rain of arrows, he's gonna automatically just counter the shit out of me. Um, bug, brother. Um, shit. So yeah. <laughs> that that's pretty fucking hot. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Uh, let's rain of arrow it and see what happens. Does that just? I'll do my no. best. <laughs> I was like, wait a minute. Does that just take it off? Does it do anything significant? Does it uh help? Is it? No, it doesn't. <laughs> Letting my arrow fly in. That was basically like a big oh, fuck you. Don't ever do it again. <laughs> Aiming shoot Now, what next? Uh, what's next is not a fucking dying is is probably what's next at this point. Let's try this. Yeah, you should definitely try that a little bit more often. Ah, uh, fuck you, die, I think. And we're just gonna go ahead and take advantage of that and just maximum fucking heal. Oh, fuck. Fuck anything else that's about to happen right now. Letting my arrow fly in true. Uh, yeah, what she said. Aim and carefully shoot true. Yeah, we Let's don't do, do a lot of damage to this thing. If we didn't have the fucking red fox, we would have been pretty much dead from this point. Yeah, other than that skill too. So yeah, that's great. Well then. Not only that, you're poisoned too. Oh, oh. Pretty fucking hot. Ah, uh, don't hurt me. He <gasps> mit. Oh. What to do? <laughs> I'm in danger. <laughs> um. Uh. Well, you, you you see what had happened was uh, yikes. Now, 
What next? Yikes. Fucking <laughs> yikes. <gasps> he dead. He dead. Not you bad. know what? Fuck it. I'll take way. it. Because that would have went a lot worse. <laughs> We're searching this village for new things. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Don't you curry me, fucker. <laughs> My life is given not in vain, for it will feed in others. Thou yeah, the we're just gonna eat now. you. <laughs> the, that's what forest, I just heard. Not is lost. Yeah, good doggos. Go ahead and devour him. Come in, my friends. This life belongeth to all. The animals that eateth the grass becometh food for the animals that eateth meat. The eaters of meat in their turn feedeth those yet stronger. Bars. And when the strongest of all dieth, his life is returned to the forest. His flesh feedeth the soil, the grass. His blood becometh sap, his bones wood. He becometh the food of the plant eaters, and the circle beginneth once more. Oh. Lives entwined, a tapestry woven anew each dawn, every thread a part of the whole. Dude, I thought she was done with the bars. Now she got, she got more. She thought of it on the fly. <laughs> now she's done. She just had to get that one last bar out. <laughs> To surviving and honoring those felled by thine own arrows. <laughs> as long as he speaketh only of hunting, he is the wisest of men. And oh, no, damn, dude, she she thought of more bars. <laughs> Jesus <sighs> Christ! If only that were all he cared about. <sighs> the hunt is over. Now it is time to tend into the fallen. If they're still alive, you know. <laughs> oh, they're already been scooped up. Some of them. The doggos are day. definitely gone. Feels bad, mate. Well. I buried him. Yes. Thou hast my thanks. But of course. Hmm? Hmm. Doggo? Oh no, he has rabies. Just so. <laughs> the hunt is on. Seems like Red Eye was too much of a challenge for him. Feels bad. And the passive just went off. We got a few gold. Uh, but first, I want to check everybody again because I don't remember what everybody had the last time we were here. Ooh. Mmm. Mm. That was kind of neat. Uh, what about you? Uh, you have an axe. Which would be nice. About you. 
coin that would be sold. I feel like finding them on NPCs is a lot cheaper than going into the stores and buying them because Battle Axe is like 1,000 necklace that gives speed. And then there's a helmet. Okay, so let's see. Bye. Battle axe. Yeah, it's a lot cheaper to find on people. I'm pretty sure you're no, you're the one down here with battle axe, right? Yeah. So find it on people is a lot cheaper than buying it at a source. Interesting. Which makes sense. Makes a lot of sense, actually. We're going to take that helmet off you. Uh, we're probably going to take the hatchet more than anything. This seems like a better idea to take the hatchet, too. But we're going to take this bow. And I think it was you that gave the hatchet, right? Yeah, we're going to take the hatchet. Okay, so inventory. First things first, let's get your weapons on. Yep, I feel like lowering the attack is a lot better anyway. Kind of the reason why I wanted it. And then we'll have the axe for a little bit more damage. We're going to give her the gear head. And... Huh. We still got to find staffs for you guys, but... Kind of rare to even get a staff right now. If we can get it off of a uh, ally or something, because examine the monsters we have, I'm pretty sure we can probably get rid of them too. No, no, we can't get rid of them. We could just have a list of them for some reason. But what ifs? Do we have any skills ready to go? Nah, nobody has skills ready to start going. So what we're going to do is that we're going to start traveling, traveling to our chapters now. So, well, actually, we could hit these on the way there, actually. Yeah, as we'll go, we'll just go down the line and everything. And we'll slowly, like, head through it because that because I think we're, we're going to be going through here. And I think we'll hit this village before we even hit this. But the thing is, if we hit this before we hit this, then we'll just go up here. Then we'll just do that in our episode. I think that would be the easier choice. So thou art going after Zonta. Hagen here came at seeking my help. In his letter, he said he was bound for Stonegard. We shall begin our search there. I pray it is no more serious than an ill-founded wager that left him unable to payeth his innkeeper. Yeah. <laughs> for a Hagen who cometh all this way alone, uh, I cannot help but fear the worst. Prithee, take us care. We will. And Don, nothing foolish. Don as Zonta saith, child, not as he would doeth. Thank ye, Chief. Fear and not for us. We shall be back before the next moon, with Master at our side. So the question is, will Hargan be part of her kids i mean that would make the right choice of putting organic part of her safe master we're kid. coming
You know what? It's kind of interesting that each story takes basically an hour or so. Okay, so that is Hannah's story, or I'm just going to not pronounce. I'm just going to call her Han. <laughs> that, that just sounds a lot better, Han. But yeah, Han's story is completed. We've passed an hour. I hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you guys on the next one. Time to start recording for the next video. Until then, peace out.